We're Ghetto Songbird and the Rocksploitation Band, and you're watching us on the Who's That Lady Music Show. Yeah. 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 everyone and welcome to who's that lady music show once again we bring you the best of indies rock pop soul dance and rap music and today we are delighted to have with us straight from philly rock and soul group ghetto songbird so stick around for an amazing interview and live performance And we're back with our special guests. Welcome to the show. Thank you so much for coming to New York. I know you guys have been here multiple times doing shows and doing your darn thing. Now, before we get into a Q&A, please introduce yourselves. I'm Ronan Ali. I am Samantha Hollins, the ghetto songbird. I'm Chris Nelson, C-Note. All right. So we have the talented trio here. Now, we're going to go ahead and get into the Q&A real quick. So when did you start learning to play the guitar? And there are there any other instruments that you play to um, write your songs and your music? I always say that the guitar chose me. I started playing in 2001 in North Philly. Um, I started playing because nobody else would play for me. I had a guitarist, and he wanted to do his own band, so... I never wanted to go through that again, so I had to pick up the guitar. But before then, I would compose my music on the piano. Oh, nice, yeah. nice, nice. That's great. Sometimes out of necessity, you know, you just have to do your own thing, which I really appreciate about a lot of independent music artists doing. You know, if they don't have a bandmate to play with or any other inspirations to get them going. So my other question to you is what's liberating about being a musician and songwriter? Wow. The freedom of being a singer, songwriter, guitarist is basically being able to express yourself at any given moment when whether you're feeling up or down, you can grab your instrument or your pen or just vocalize. That's inspiration for me. All right. So, again, going into the inspirational part, what's inspirational for you the most? Um, now, performing live, what is the craziest thing that you've ever seen? And I'm going to ask, that's a, a question for all three of you, starting with a man right here. Uh, performing live, Ghetto Songbird. The craziest, yeah, it was cool. We played the Cosmic Slop Festival over in Detroit. Oh, nice. And uh, it was a nice building with no roof. The cafe itself had a roof, but where we were playing at had no roof. So it was cool. It was clear night sky. You can see the stars and the music and the crowd. It was, it was, it was everything. It was dope. Yeah, yeah. So what's the craziest for you? Again, it's like crazy but dope at the same time. Out of nowhere, I get an inbox from this guy by the name of Adu Jamal in L.A. Uh -huh. Never met him a day in my life. Can I play with you? And I, I was moved to say, sure, just come to Soundcheck and let's see if you fit in. Uh -huh. He played this djembe. He came in, and he fit in. And for now, for when we travel, he pops up at shows, yeah. and he plays with us. He's like the quiet member of this band. Oh, he's the silent member. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> and what's the craziest for you, Chris? Uh, watching Gail Summer on stage in L.A. one time, and she had a um, camera phone. And first time ever, she just turned around with, with the crowd while she was performing. We was off on, off on, off the stage, you know, and just first time just enjoying the energy. So watching her just doing her thing, you know, just the, you know, the, the camera phone. Yeah, yeah, seeing it with the camera phone and all this other crazy technology. It seems like nowadays you don't need an actual big equipment to do your thing. Yeah. You know, you have fans enjoying it as well as participating. Yeah. Um, 
Now, my my other two questions, I have like another couple of questions, is what is your musical influence? Life itself. I'm inspired by everything that goes on around me and inside me as well. Just connecting with that energy in the audience sometimes draws inspiration to create new songs. But if you want to speak on a musician type of point of view, I will go back to Jimi Hendrix, Sister Rosetta Tharp, Prince, uh, Billy Holiday, yeah. Sade. Yeah. Speaking of Sister Rosetta, I hear that you're going to be doing a performance in a couple of weeks in tribute to her. So which is exciting. Uh, could you tell us a little bit more about that? Yes, it's going to be at what they call the Women's International Leadership Summit in Philadelphia mm -hmm. on the I think the 27th through the 30th, I'll be performing the 29th. You can always go on my social media outlets to um, get more information about that, which is always under Ghetto Songbird. All right, all right. And in one word, I'm going to ask each, each of you guys, in one word, describe your sound. Majestic. Hours. <laughs> <laughs> Mysterious. Mysterious, majestic, and ours, meaning it's for us, by us, produced by us, and we do it for us. Now, now tell the music lover where we can find you guys online. We're going to have the information on the screen, of course, but it's always good to vocalize that as well. Everything for Samantha Holland's The Ghetto Songbird is on every social media outlet, but you can also go to ReverbNation.com slash Ghetto Songbird to pretty much learn about what I call my history because I started in 2001. I've been doing this for a minute, yeah. so everything you need to know about me is right there. You can also go on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, I'm there. All right, all right, and there, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. So stick around and hear this amazing kick as performance by these wonderful talented trio here ghetto songbird so stick around Enchanted like a rock garden Enchanting, enchanting Enchanting like a rock garden
Uchi 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 Please don't mess with me Uchi 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 Please don't mess with me Uchi 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 Please don't mess with me Uchi 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 Please don't mess with me
forehead I'm blocking the lies of the walking dead Radiating, breathing energy, a power so bright This truth will shine like a guiding light As wide as the east to the west Aligning us all on the spiritual quest From the saints to the sinner to the naive to the righteous I know that you are watching us The eye of the sky, there's a vision hiding in the clouds
Sucker plus sucker Feeding off this flesh of mine Mother sucker plus
Who's That Lady Music Show crew would like to thank Ghetto Songbird for stopping by. And we want to thank you, the viewers, for watching us. See you next time. Peace.